Hey guys, happy Monday. Uh, if you guys are new to my channel, uh, welcome. My name is Biz. I am on a weight loss journey. Uh, I am now over 30 pounds lost. I like lost 1.2 this week. Uh, I am following the Weight Watcher program and that weight loss has taken me since January of 2022 and I'm completely fine with that. In years past, I can't tell you how many times my birthday's in January or my birthday's in March. In January, Every year I used to tell myself I was going to lose 20 pounds by my birthday. That never happened, so I'd give up and eat like an asshole for a day, week, months before, you know, coming back to, the, to what I know works, and that's Weight Watchers. But the difference this time is that I have um, changed my mindset. I'm going to talk about three things that have helped me in the last um, just over uh, 18 months. No, how, how much? Today's is January, so that's... Today's July. July. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever it is, how long, however long it's been since January of 2022, uh, this is what I've done to uh, to help my my mind. And once you like can switch the mindset, is when the body will follow. I wholeheartedly heartily agree with that. So one is a losing the timetable on how long it's going to take you to lose the weight. Just let, let it let it go because bodies are weird and it takes time and it's consistency over perfection. I, every January, I would have so many balls in the air. I was going to drink a gallon of water, 10,000 steps, like a laundry list of things. And I could maybe keep those balls in the air for a, a, a two, three weeks, something like that. The second one fell to the ground, I consider myself a failure and just dropped it all and just went back to my old ways. That, um, so that's one. Two is that I treat my uh, Weight Watcher points like currency. It's it's a budget and you have to look ahead and see, much like you do a budget in your house, uh, you have to see what you want to spend it on. So if I, on a Sunday, my day starts over uh, today, um, on Mondays, I will look ahead and see, oh, do I have a brunch out maybe on the weekend and maybe dinner at my daughter's house. I'm going to automatically put 25 points to both of those. And then I don't even track what I eat that, I just say it's 25 points, whatever it is, it might be a little bit more, it might be a little bit less. But then I subtract that from my total weekly points. I always eat, like, so my daily points, it's 100, I get 28 points in a day. I'm like rambling, it's gonna be okay, we're gonna figure it out. I get 20 points a day times seven. So whatever that number is, I subtract 50 for those two meals that are gonna be out more than I normally spend. And that way I don't have any guilt with those two meals. Like I used to, if I went to a restaurant, told myself I was gonna get a salad and the restaurant's known for burgers and I get a burger, I was like, well, I just can't, I can't, you know, keep up with this healthy lifestyle. But it's not about eating healthy all the time. 80-20 is probably great if you can even do that. Uh, so that's number two. And number three is I don't really care about the gallon of water anymore. I, that used to be my goal, like, uh, and I I don't think, have you ever had a gallon of water in a day, Hannah? Like twice. Yeah, and it's just, it's not for me. So what I do is I just look at the color of my pee. If it's pale yellow, I know I'm drinking enough. If it's darker, I drink more water. That's it. I'm not measuring, I'm not doing anything because I think when I had too many numbers in my head, it was just, and we're not math people. We are not mathematics. We are not mathematics, uh, uh, Biz and Hannah are not. So uh, that's why I just, the only numbers I care about are my diabetes numbers and my weight watcher points and the, that's it and I'm able to maintain those two. So if uh, you are on a weight loss journey and um, you are struggling to, like you th don't think you're seeing results is just give it time, a month at least. Uh, and sometimes maybe two months. Uh, when I started reframing my uh, mindset by the end, by my birthday of 2022, uh, which was eight, nine, 10, 11 weeks, I had lost eight pounds. And I would have thought that was not enough and I would have given up, but just consistency. And then time is also, so if you just keep consistently, over time you're gonna get there. So uh, let me know uh, in the comments below uh, how you're doing, how your journey's going, and um, if you're not subscribed already. What? How come they're not subscribed, Yana? I know, hit the freaking bell. Hit the, hit the freaking bell. Uh, you'll get notified every time we uh, upload a video. And uh, we'll just see you next time. Hi. <laughs>